Sheridan Smith is reportedly gearing up to take her one-woman Shirley Valentine show on the road for a mega UK tour, which could see bank up to £500,000. It comes following the success of her West End production, which netted £4 million in advance sales and was met with high praise from critics. Sheridan stars as a middle-aged lonely heart who was first portrayed by Pauline Collins in a 1989 film of the same name. Theatre director David Pugh said, I want to bring Shirley to the people, but only if it's Sheridan. She is perfect in every way. Sheridan has been inundated with film and TV offers because of the success of Shirley. Her agent is on holiday but I think they're going to have a look at all these wonderful offers. But if we could take Sheridan as Shirley around the country I would love to. There hasn't been an empty seat yet. Sheridan hasn't missed a laugh. The Sun on Sunday reports the tour could net Sheridan up to £500,000. An industry insider told the paper that early discussions had begun in a bid to take the production to regional theatres. Last month, Sheridan, 41, was joined by her son Billy in the Willie Russell play at the Duke of York's Theatre, London. The play is running until June 3. The original production of Shirley Valentine premiered in 1986 starring Noreen Kershaw and directed by Glenn Walford. The play is a life-affirming story of a woman who has found herself lost in marriage and motherhood as she talks about her life to the kitchen wall whilst cooking her husband's eggs and chips. Sheridan found early fame playing Smithy's sister in hit BBC comedy Gavin and Stacey, and has gone on to a string of winning performances. She was a stage hit in the musical version of hit film Legally Blonde, a success in the gritty role of Mrs. Biggs, wife of great train robber Ronnie, and the choice to play Scylla Black in an ITV drama about her life.